idea is we follow the torch. We would like our students to be truthful, organized, reflective, courageous and helpful. Dominicans are truthful. It is inspired by the way of Saint Dominic, the way he lived his life in the 800 years of the Order of Pictures. Actualizing the very vision mission of Dominican International School, which is preaching, DIS motivates every single stakeholder to apply the students' learning outcomes. All subjects offered by our school actually infuse this value so that the students will achieve not only academic but also moral excellence. Dominicans are truthful, and everywhere we go, in every corner of the world, we ought to proclaim the truth. Infuse the gospel in the universal values and the Dominican values inspired by our Holy Father, Saint Dominic, and Saint Thomas Aquinas for all Dominicans around the world. Students at DIS learn to be organized. There are many requirements of students, so they need to be organized to really set their goals and to be able to see their goals through until they accomplish their goals. There are also many aspects in school that they need to set their goals for. They need to be healthy academically, also physically and spiritually. Then also, we like to teach our students to be very organized in terms of the resources that they use to reach their goals. One of the expected school-wide learning results or SLRs we develop among our students with the example and role modeling by our administrators, teachers, and staff is being reflective. Our DIS students are critical thinkers the way they speak, write, and interact with others. They develop an attitude of contemplation where they find time to be quiet, especially to be at peace with themselves despite academic pressures, and personal concerns. Being reflective means that our students learn how to respond and to react positively with the demands of family and society in today's 21st century. As a guidance counselor, being reflective is very important in planning, decision making, and the implementation of my task, especially in college preparation. To further guide our students, I need to heighten my intuitive skills and it will only happen if you, I, are reflective thinkers and applying the reflective thinking skills in our daily life. You are leaving your passion or you are leaving your dreams. What's your greatest personal achievements? Many players and athletes are talented, but the problem is they're afraid to try, they're afraid to lose. If someone says you can't make it, some parts of this you want to make it. But the key use of this present behavior is not to try. You are fear of losing. Ladies and gentlemen, it takes courage to live your dreams. It takes courage to manifest your greatness. It takes courage to decide to live. To decide to bring all your talent and abilities to stretch out to decide to win the game it takes courage to try your limits we are the warriors of our faith standing and afraid if you are courageous you can make everything helpful. We evaluate all decisions in light of the common good. We are compassionate and caring to each other and 
not only to each other. We also respect and care for the environment.